Hello everyone. So today we will perform the terrain analysis for which we will import the Mi 300 TIF raster data. Now we will find out the hill shading contour analysis and we will see the elevation map. So let's go to QGIS project. We will open a new project. Now we will add a raster layer. So click on layer, add raster layer. Now here yeah, click on the browse button and then go to the data set. The data set link is already given in the description. You can copy the data set from there. From this data set, I have to take MEA300 TIF file. So I'll select this file and I'll click on open. So this file will be open. Now I'll click and add it to my project. Now this file is added. So I will close this file. As you can see, this is the map of the India. Now I will zoom into the Himalaya region. From this, I will click on raster extraction, clip raster by extent. So I will take this layer. Now I will use the canvas extent. So I'll click here and I'll click on use canvas extent. Now by default, the name is given as clipped. So I'll click on run. Now I'll wait for, I'll close this window. So I will see one clip layer is created. This is the layer that is clipped from the entire image of India. Now for the calculations we'll be performing on this layer. So I'll click on raster extraction contour. Now for my input layer is clipped and band number one, then interval between this, I'll take it as 1000. So between the contour lines, there is a distance of 1000 meters. Now I'll click on run. then I will be able to see the contour lines on the screen. So I'll close this window. As we can see the contour lines, contour lines are isolines, which are actually connecting the areas with same height. Now, if I want to know the height, so I can right click and I can change the property. So I'll go to properties. Then from there, I will add the labels. So I'll click on the labels tab. Then here no labels is selected. I will select single label. Then there are different fields. I will select the elevation and click on apply and then OK. So you will be able to see the numbers. Numbers are actually the height of different contour lines. So I can see the height over here. Now, if I want to zoom to the highest point, then I have to go to contour, then open attribute table. Then here I can see two fields, ID and elevation. So I'll click on elevation. Now it is arranged in ascending order. If I click it again, now it is arranged in descending order. So my highest point is 8000. So I will select this particular row and I will click on zoom map to selected row. So if I click here, then I close this window. I can see that the map is zoomed to layer with height 8000. Now let's go for hill shading. So I click on raster analysis hill shade. Input layer will be the clipped layer and remaining will remain as it is. And then I click on run. So once the execution is finished, I'll be able to see the hill shade. So if I zoom out this map, then I'll be able to see the hill shade. It is actually based on the position of sun and the light. So thank you. Thanks for watching.